Yo guys, what is going on? SCFC on Scott Curtis here. We're back again, brand new video, and this morning the new kits have been released. And this is what they look like. Well, well, I, it's pretty much all right. Home shirt's actually really nice, but the away kit I'm not really um, sure about, to be honest. But the goalkeeper kit's a bit uh, hit and miss as well, sort of. But um, I think the home shirt's the nicest one out of them all. On there, just yeah, it's just my opinion. The home shirt's a nice one. I'll probably be wearing a home shirt next season. But um, anyway, in other news, Swansea have actually signed a player. And our first signing is the Queen's Park Rangers left back on a free agent, Jake Bidwell. Well, he's got a bit of experience. Obviously, he's played for Brentford and QPR. He made about 46 appearances, I believe. 46 or something like that um, for Queen's Park Rangers. And um, he is a main left back. I think he played against us when we um, um, twice when we lost 4-0 and um, when we beat them 3-0 at home. I think he played then, but um, apparently he's been spotted wearing number 16 trousers, but that's obviously Joel Soru's number. But I think, in my opinion, he should be more like the number three because there's no number three, unless if Declan John is having a number three, that probably could be why. But um, he, he, the problem is that um, he does give away silly fouls, though. Sometimes gives away stupid penalties. So here's his full stats here. So as you can see, he's made 374 appearances for Brentford and QPR. 50 yellow cards, one red card. He scored um, a few goals, I think, seven goals, if I have to believe, and 32 assists. And yeah, that's um, not bad for a left back. Um, he is quite um, dirty sometimes, as he gives away silly fouls, being told by that. But we've got a bit of experience, so I think, I think he should be first choice left back, just my opinion, because of his experience. And um, yeah, we'll move on to transfer rumours. And obviously, Ollie McBurney's been linked to Sheffield United, but he's been, he's travelled with a squad in Spain, which which gives us a good sign. But Jefferson Montero and Boya Baston have not travelled. But neither have Christopher Northfield, Burson Cena, Joel Osora. But they they have they said they were linking up with a squad yesterday. They pretty much have now. But um, Jefferson Montero is linked with. Um, Deportivo Toluca in Mexico, I believe, but also Birmingham City are after him. But um, in my opinion, if we're going to get rid of Montero, it's got to be permanent, full stop. It's got to be permanent it's because we need to cut the wage bill and we're going to need some money. Also, Boya Bastard has not travelled yet. Obviously, five weeks um, until we have to sort a deal for him out. But I've been told by a friend that um, Kiva Verona are after him for... 1.5 million, but um, I don't know if it's true or not because I haven't seen any articles on this. I've just been told that, but um, we need to sell him. Like if it, it'll be so stupid to put players out on loan like we don't need, because I think we need to cut the wage bill, sell them so we can spend some money. The 30 million hole as well. We've got to fill that, and also um, Andre Ayew and John A. Obviously the Ayew brothers. Apparently, I've also been told that Andre could be off to Hapo Tel Aviv in Israel. Jordan Ayew could be off to Nice, but I'm not entirely sure about that. But um, I haven't seen any articles. Obviously, the thing is, oh, who's going to want them? It might not be true, but um, you never know. But um, yesterday, Jake Bidwell, it came out of absolute nowhere because Stuart James, a reporter for the Swans, is um, a very reliable journalist. He said it and we signed him. Like, it could be one of these. Also, there's a rumour that Barry Mackay could be off to Queen's Park Rangers. I've mentioned in it, it's been mentioned in a transfer on a EFL Championship transfer news on um, Twitter and Facebook. And they said they're meant to be signing him today. I don't know if it's true or not because I haven't seen any articles such as like Wales Online or BBC Sky. It's, it's probably going to come out of nowhere as usual because you know Tom Carroll went to Aston Villa on loan. That went. That that came out of absolute nowhere as well. But um, also, uh, George Byers, um, he will stay, I think. But um, apparently, Watford won him for four million. They won him back for him, and he came through the academy of Watford. But I I I think this one's false. But um, I've been I've also been told that as well. I've I've also been told Kean Harris and Yandanda could be going on loan. Yandanda could be off to Barnsley on loan. 
Cade Harris could be off to Dundee if I have to believe on loan. Dundee or Hearts, one of them two. Dundee United, Dundee United on loan, but um, also Bossy BRB could be off to Colchester on loan. I think Bossy BRB, he is a decent striker for the under-23s, but um, I think he'll probably go on loan again. Colchester United have been after him well. Um, I've been told that as well, and I've also been told about Jay Fulton being linked to Rangers. I don't think any of these are true, but I've just been told that, okay? So don't judge me. So, um, I think... I don't think... I think, um... I think most of them will stay, but um, obviously most of them have travelled to Spain, except for Montero and Boya Baston. Well, obviously the AU brothers are in uh, Africa Cup of Nations with Ghana. But, um, you guys, um, there's no articles around at the moment, so you never know. Something could pop up, like Stuart James could say something, possibly. But, um, you guys, I don't know if these rumours are true, but, um... We're after a few players on loan as well. I've also been told that as well. The players I wanted in, as you may know, I, I told you last week, just uh, just under last week, um, Ben would burn Lee Smoozette and Reese James on loan, but I don't see Reese James happening now because we signed Jake Bidwell. Um, but we're after Bobby um, Adekanye from Liverpool on loan, um, Joe Pereira on loan from Man United. And apparently, um, this is not true, but Wilfred Boney um, about coming back, I've... I don't, I've, I'm not sure if this is made up or not, but I've been told by a special friend about that. And, um, there is all, and also we are after, after, we're also after Jack Hendry from Celtic. But, um, I don't think these rumours are true, but, um, I've just been told that by someone. It's apparently, but uh, I haven't seen any articles, but I'll keep you more updated if it's true. But yeah, guys, I've just been told all these rumours. Obviously, um, I'm happy that we signed a player. At last, Jake Bidwell, but obviously it's a free transfer, and uh, the new kits have been launched. So yeah, guys, um, if you want to see more news content, then uh, make sure you like this video, subscribe, turn on post notifications, check my game channel, SCFC and Scope Gaming. Yeah, peace.